Assalamu alaikum dear students you are watching MLT MCQs I am Kamran today MCQs will be from acetic fluid and we will talk about nine important MCQs so let's start the MCQs our MCQ number one is pathological collection of fluid in the peritoneal cavity is called blank fluid Options for this MCQ are synovial, acetic, pericardial or plural and the right answer for this MCQ is option number 2 acetic. MCQ number 2 is which of the following condition is responsible for accumulation of acetic fluid? Options are Leishmaniasis, Diarrhea, Malaria or Tuberculosis and the right answer for this MCQ is option number 4 Tuberculosis. MCQ number 3 is Normal color of acetic fluid is blank colored. Options are pink, blue, straw or black and the right answer for this MCQ is option number 3 straw normal color of acetic fluid is straw colored. MCQ number 4 is cloudy color acetic fluid is due to presence of white blood cells or blank options are rupture red blood cells microorganisms or epithelial cells and the right answer for this mcq is option number 3 microorganisms cloudy color acetic fluid is due to the presence of white blood cells and microorganisms mcq number 5 is Yellow color acetic fluid is due to presence of liver disease or blank. Options are heart attack, insomnia, red blood cells or lymphatic system obstruction. Right option for this MCQ is option number 4. Yellow color acetic fluid is due to presence of liver disease or lymphatic system obstruction. MCQ number 6 is green color acetic fluid is due to presence of blank. Options are G6PD, lipase, amylase or bile and the right option for this MCQ is option number 4. Green color acetic fluid is due to presence of bile. MCQ number 6 is high number of white blood cells in acetic fluid indicate options are malignancy, normal fluid, swelling or parasitic infection and the right answer for this MCQ is option number 1 high number of white blood cells in acetic fluid indicate malignancy. MCQ number 8 is high number of lymphocytes in acetic fluid indicate options are tuberculosis, typhoid, arthritis or rheumatic fever and the right answer for this MCQ is option number 1 high number of lymphocytes in acetic fluid indicate tuberculosis. Last MCQ is acetic fluid should be analyzed for options are appearance, cell count, serum acetic albumin gradient or all of the above and the right answer for this MCQ is option number 4. Acetic fluid should be analyzed for appearance, for cell count and for serum acetic 
albumin gradient. So, the option number 4 is the right one. Thank you so much dear students for watching MLT MCQs. If you found this video useful, like this video, share it with your friends, take good care of yourself. Allah Hafiz.